it's Amanda. Welcome to my channel. Today we are going to be planning in my catch-all planner. It is an Erin Condren A5 Daily Duo for the week of Monday the 14th through the 20th of November. And I'm using a old pinky stickers printable called Bookworm. I do not believe it is on their Etsy site anymore. So sadly, that's the one thing about printables is once you have them, you have them. <laughs> But y'all, y'all, thank you so much for subscribing for you guys, the 397 subscribers that I have. Oh my gosh, I'm so close to 100. Just need three more subscribers. So if you do enjoy these kind of videos, I do planning, I do fitness planning, I do writing, I do budgeting, I do all kinds of random stuff on this site and this channel, you know. So um, I have a lot of stuff planned for December with all the new, um, you know, setting up all my new planners for, for you know, the next 2023. So if you enjoy that kind of stuff, please subscribe so you can uh, be notified of when I post. Um, so yeah, thank you guys so much. But on to the plan with me. This is an interest, like this kit, I really wish I had more kits like this. And I think this is the only version of this kit that actually has this, but it has like not just to do things, but it also had like meal planning things, um, which you'll see, you, you would have seen in my, um, in my work plan with me, but they also have like steps and sleep and stuff. And this is what I'm going to, I'm going to use some of this stuff in my fitness planning later this week. Um, but yeah, this is like one of those perfect kits that has like everything in it that you, without having like way too much stuff, like some, like some of the stuff like, um, no, don't get me wrong. My favorite, my favorite one is, um, Print Petticoat Bandit, but some of the stuff can get <laughs> a little, a little excessive. Um, but it like, it leans to, you know, people who do memory planning and things like that, or at least more decorative planning, like, um, what is it, Shantae, Shantae plans and, um, and that group, like, who do, like, really decorative stuff, because it also includes, like, foiling, like, things to foil with and all that jazz. So I'm going to go ahead and, where is my start with putting down the habit tracker. I think I'm just going to put the habit tracker back where it belongs down in here. Unlike I did this, where is it? This week where I put it at the top. I think I'm just going to put it down at the bottom where I usually put it. So that I also have enough room. When I put it up here, I wasn't able to use, um, I wasn't able to put as many trackers as I usually put in. Now, next year, since I'm going to be using a um, Happy Planner Vertical uh, as my weekly planner, I'm not going to be able to do this particular version of habit tracking, so I will probably do more of a monthly habit tracker. Um, or since I will be having multiple planners um, that I will be Franken planning and putting together into one carry Franken planner, something similar to this um, to carry around with me uh, instead of an A5. Um, and I might only carry certain ones with me, like my work catch-all and fitness in one and then have a second one that just stays at home f that has like uh, my budget um, or I'll just keep my budget planner by itself and my memory planner by itself because right now that Franken planner that I just showed you has um, my memory planner which I've been using a daily um, like a sort of a mock TPC hybrid planner, TPC Nation hybrid planner, um, that I made myself in there. And I think 
I don't really need that all the time. So I think I might be using a horizontal for journaling and just adding um, adding my brain just stopped working for a second. <laughs> Gailies at if I need them and using up some of my happy planner uh, duck grid pages that I have from notebooks and think I have so many accessories and extension packs and whatnot that I just need to start using it up and I think this is probably the best way to do it and I've already I pretty much have sort of figured out my um hey buddy the doggo has decided to come say hi He's mad that I'm not paying attention to him. <laughs> He's like, you've been gone all day. Pay attention to me. Don't worry. Once I finish this, I'll pay attention to you. No, he's he's really not like that. He's he's very much just chilling out. I think he's going to go eat his food. <laughs> so if you hear like crunching and munching in the background, that's what he's doing. All right, I think what I'm going to do this time is I think I'm gonna put this one here because I need to cover up that white out as usual. And then I'm going to alter kind of alternate the blue. I have a couple, there's a couple more. These are like happy planner sized, which is kind of odd since this is an Erin Condren sized planner. But I think I'm just gonna alternate the darker color with the lighter color as best as I can. I don't really like this one, but I guess I'll use it. This is still plain. It's hanging off the page a little bit. Let me bring this over a little bit more. There we go. And then I'm going to put This one says, a book is a dream that you hold in your hand, which is cute. And then this one. Actually, I think I need to switch these up because that's two, two kind of like gray based ones behind each other, well, next to each other. And then put this gray one here. I put the bookshelves here. Of course, I've been doing a book themed kit every week, so I finished uh, that one. Don't need this one. I don't. I don't use these in my planner. I might. I'm probably going to need these. Not any of these. I'm not going to use washi in this one. I think that's pretty much it that I need from this kit. Okay, so we're going to put down these four. Okay, come on. For all the days that I need videos. Start with is this the light one? Oh my god, these colors look exactly the same now. Okay, that's the darker one. That's the dark. Okay. <laughs> so I'm gonna put this one here. And then a gray one. Then I'm gonna use this one. No, yeah. I'm gonna just try to separate the pinks. By using different colors. Let's do the darker pink, then the gray, then the lighter pink. Let's see, do I have Bildu? I did not think to put that in here. So the 15th, which is Tuesday, I need to get some 
stairs, but there is, I didn't see any build ooze in here, did I? Interesting. Okay, so I'll just use uh, on Tuesday. Let's do this. Uh, let's just fling the things across the page and put it this way for the bill dues Tuesday. Then I have one due on Saturday. And then we'll use this. that way. And I'm going to use some of these little stick my bobs and I'm just going to match the colors. Oh man, you can barely see. On that one. Whew. And on this one, I'm just going to put one of these stars. So I can check it off. Use what you got. Okay. So, TV. That one. That one. This one. There's no star in the teal, so we'll just use this one. And then on Friday, of course, Friday is payday. But it is also... Just go ahead and use the blue. PTO day. So I'm just going to use this one on this side. And do... Oh, poo! Okay, I'm going to have to use... No, because I don't want the same color. I'm just going to use a little cake for my PTO and payday. Because, you know, celebrate! Okay. I think that's it. It was the 28th in my budget with me that I just recorded that I was like, what day is it? I think it's the 28th. It is the 28th. That's the day that I need to my Kindle Unlimited subscription ends. Uh, I bought a new one. Well, not, I'm going to. I haven't bought a new one. I'm going to buy a new one. So I need date dots. Let's see what's in here. What's what's I got? I need the fourteenth on fourteenth through the twenty first. Oh, that's not gonna work. Okay. I guess I'm just gonna start pulling them from this one. Ha! Huh. There's oh there's 16. I was about to say I'm gonna have 16 is randomly missing out of this one. But we need yeah, starting at the 14th. Okay. Let's see. 14 can go here. Oh, these are gonna work perfectly. 14. These are just just random. Um, stickers left over from I used to do just um, when I first started doing Happy Planner I would just buy extension kits which you know I really should start doing again they're, they would be cheaper <laughs> especially when they're undated um, but I've been buying uh, full kits well full kits full planners um, usually on sale and just redating them but that's what these sheets are for from our old undated kits undated stuff that I've just held on to because I'm like I can always use numbers <laughs> you can always use more numbers all right put that aside and put that back 
All right, that's pretty much it for this plan with me. Like today is um, Friday, well, Thursday afternoon. Um, and I'm trying to get a head start on my planning and my roommate is going to be back soon from work. Um, she works pretty late and it's almost six. Um, her office works odd hours. Um, so she'll be back soon. Um, so I wanted to get as many as I could done, but yeah, today's just Thursday. Um, so I hope you enjoyed. I, that's why I was about to say, that's why I am not going to put the weather in using these little headers that I make myself. Um, I will put those in later when it gets closer to, I usually do it on like either Sunday night or Monday morning and put in Monday through Thursday. And then I do Friday, Saturday, Sunday when it gets closer because the weather around here changes so much. So I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please give a like, comment down below, subscribe because I'm only as, almost at 400 subscribers. Yay! Um, thank you again for subscribing and I will see you guys next time. Bye!